Oh, did you guys see the aliens? Oh, we got Mexican aliens. We got Mexican aliens. Let me see if I can find a video. Find a video like it's not all over the internet. Let's see. Mexico alien. What is this? Human Actually, I'll play that after. That's not the real or the video they showed. De acuerdo a la universidad. Oh yeah, here it is. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This can't be. <laughs> I I mean I know this this isn't real. But this can't be the Mexican like government actually trying to play this off. This is a, this has to be like shot for something, right? Son seres no humanos que no son parte de nuestra evolución terrestre y que we find después the de desaparecer no the hay aircraft? una yeah. evolución posterior. Little, like, little drones? De acuerdo a la Universidad Come Nacional Autónoma. Come the fuck on. Quien realizó los análisis. It was like made out of paper mache. Do you notice how they're shooting it too? There's like very specific angles. We don't go too close up. It's the first uncovering of like alienoid bodies. You think there'd be like, be a little more. I mean, they show one close up, but it's like at a weird angle. There's no dead on shot of it. Estos seres tienen alrededor de mil años de antiguo know what he's saying don't even know what he's saying oh there's uh <laughs> there's subtitles right there they were covered sorry let me read it back there that were covered in birds that are crashes but they are being uh, that were buried in mines what retards fucking translated this shit civilization with 17 million alien what is that word? Phytop, phyto, phytoplankton, which was abundant. What? At the time when it was, when it disappeared, it became possible. I must have missed some context at the beginning. Jesus Christ. They are beings, not human, who are... Uh, who are not part of our terrestrial evolution and that after disappearing, we do not. There is a, do not what? All right, I can't. Maybe I'm stupid and I can't read these, these subtitles, but they seem to not make sense to me. Um, but yeah, that's, uh, it's aliens, aliens guys. You see what I mean when I said the first time the government started talking about aliens, I was just like, this is just so anticlimactic for the alien human species story arc that we had going on. This is not the way it was supposed to happen. This is, this movie's a dud. It's like when you, yeah, like when you watch a movie, you're like, oh man, like the first, the first half of that movie was amazing. It's like Independence Day. That's kind of what, how Independence Day, you could describe it the same way. First half of the movie was amazing, but then it just, just lost me towards the end. That's how I feel about real life aliens. Now, I heard this was debunked, but I don't, I haven't seen the debunking. I wonder if maybe that. That video I saw before, <clears throat> excuse me, was debunking it. Oh, it's a hoax. And it refreshes. Thank you. Thank you for keeping me up to date. I appreciate it. Biden 2024. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, 
let's see. What do you think? Oh, this is like a like a real close up. Horseshit. This is horseshit. I'll be real. I don't trust the Mexicans to to keep good documents. I don't know about this. Could be my racism. However, I don't think that is. I don't think they're known for keeping good documentation. <clears throat> what do you guys think? The same dude was caught making fake aliens from mummies. Oh, okay, I see. That must be where the debunking, the debunking came from. The real illegal aliens. <laughs> good one, Pete. Good one. <clears throat> I thank you, Brian, for the uh, the information there. They look like Jeff Dun Dunham's puppets. Birdman, exactly. I'm surprised Birdman even knows who Jeff Dunham is. I didn't know Jeff Dunham was uh, I didn't know the hood fucks with Jeff Dun Je Jeff Dunham. He should get a black puppet. Mexican Mexico barely has a government. Exactly. Exactly. This has to be some funded, some kind of funded from a corporation or something. They look too small to cut my grass. <laughs> Are you talking about the aliens or the guys presenting the aliens? Um, no, the guys presenting it are just the right height to cut your grass. Yeah, I just don't, and if that is real aliens, I'm no longer in fear of the thought of them taking over and doing anything special. Yeah, that's kind of that's kind of where I sit. He does have a black puppet, does he? Jesus, I guess I guess uh, he knows knows better than I do. Oh, that wasn't Birdman though. I honestly I didn't know he had a black puppet. That 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 must be hilarious. Um Yeah, I guess that's it. That's all I have to say on on that. And why do they also look like they just were like dug out of the ground? Why is there dirt around them? Like wouldn't they have already kind of dusted them off and cuz they're saying that they had these in captivity for a long time. This is just all wrong. Even their presentation. They just don't have the... They don't have the sort of like... The ingenuity in terms of like... Like tricking somebody. It's like third world practical jokes. They're not as like... Well thought out. But they still get the people. That's the funny thing in it. Um, the black puppet is named Sweet Daddy D. That is what a white guy would name a black puppet. Like, he thought that was a really cool name. Sweet Daddy D. It must be. It's, 